ISTQB Foundation Level, Question 268. Given the following task descriptions, 1. The quality characteristics to be evaluated and the exit criteria are selected. 2. Everyone has access to the work product. 3. Anomalies are identified in the work product. 4. Anomalies are discussed. And the following review activities. A. Individual review. B. Review initiation. C. Planning. D. Communication and analysis. Which of the following best matches the task descriptions and activities? A. 1 is B, 2 is C, 3 is D, 4 is A. B. 1 is B, 2 is D, 3 is C, 4 is A. C. 1 is C, 2 is A, 3 is B, 4 is D. D. 1 is C, 2 is B, 3 is A, 4 is D. Take a moment to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to don't miss new ISTQB questions and answers that will help you guaranteed and changing your skills. Join us on this learning journey. If you find value in that I do and my videos help you, then you have the option to donate through the links in the video description to I can release new videos on ISTQB questions on a regular basis. Let's look at all the task descriptions from 1 to 4 according to ISTQB syllabus. Task 1. The quality characteristics to be evaluated and the exit criteria are selected corresponds to review activity C. Planning. During the planning, reviewers define the review scope, purpose, work product to be reviewed, quality characteristics to be evaluated, areas of focus, exit criteria, supporting information such as standards, effort and time frames. Task 2. Everyone has access to the work product corresponds to review activity B. Review initiation. During the review initiation, it is necessary to ensure that all participants have access to the work product and necessary resources and clarify their roles and responsibilities. Task 3. Anomalies are identified in the work product corresponds to the review activity A. Individual review. During the individual review, each participant of review evaluates the work product's quality, identifies and logs anomalies, recommendations, and questions using review techniques, like checklist-based and scenario-based reviewing. Task 4. Anomalies are discussed corresponds to review activity D. Communication and analysis. During the communication and analysis, reviewers are analyzing and discussing each anomaly, determining its status, ownership and required actions, and making review decisions normally in a meeting. This could include determining the need for a follow-up review. In summary, all of the above leads us to the correct answer D. 1 is C, 2 is B, 3 is A, 4 is D. My recommendation. Please remember all the review activities 
and its tasks to pass STFL exam. Explanation. At last, let's look at the section 3.2.2, review process activities in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see that during the planning phase, quality characteristics to be evaluated, exit criteria shall be defined. During review initiation, every participant has access to the work product under review. Individual review. Every reviewer performs to identify anomalies. Communication and analysis. All these anomalies need to be analyzed and discussed. This is fully consistent with the correct answer D. I am sincerely sure that you will pass the ISTQB Certified Tester Foundation Level exam. If you thoroughly watch through all the questions on my video channel, ISTQB questions. Don't stop and never give up.